player. What's up everybody? As I said, yes, it is 4th of July. Happy 4th of July, everyone. Um, as most of you probably know, I am in the military, so this is very special to me, being that I am serving this great country's birthday in the U.S. military, and this will probably be my last one active duty Navy sailor on the 4th of July. And I wanted to write a little something because I know there's a lot of craziness in the world right now. I wrote a little, it's not a poem, it's just like my thoughts and feelings about what's going, what we're going through and what's happening. And I just want to make a short video to reflect on how I feel about what's going on and how I think that uh, I love where we live and I love, uh, love my uh, family and friends. So if you guys care to listen, it's just a little, insert a little uh, little poem slash like statement I'm making and uh, I think you'll enjoy it. I call it America's my home forever. What is one place that you can be whatever you want to be? You can be a doctor, a writer, movie producer, superstar, athlete, baker, butcher, actor, YouTuber, farmer. Where were the laws written so that everyone has a fair shake? Where can any person of any color, race, or gender be successful? Where is a place that has had many struggles, and I mean a lot, of trials and tribulations in the past that are very sad, but has come back stronger than ever. And through remembering those past struggles, we can improve ourselves to move forward. What country has won two world wars that could have brought humanity to its knees if they didn't win? And what country is so bad to some that even though they hate its guts, they still won't leave because it's the best place around. You spit on us, beat us, try to bring us down from within, but this country won't give up and keeps fighting. This country's men and women die for it and it inspires others in their family and friends to take up that mantle and do the same. And lastly, what country will I die for to defend and preserve because she is beautiful, she is strong, and she is glorious? That's America, baby. Thank you guys for listening to that. As you can see, I'm a proud American. Uh, I feel like our country is falling on its knees right now and everybody is just caught up in minutia of issues that we are having and we need to focus on bigger things like trying to preserve what was great about this country and not get into semantics of little stuff. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy this 4th of July and until next time, this has been an episode of Mountain.